why we started this why we started this uh, program is that you know nowadays being an entrepreneur is very tough and then for those driving and young or old uh, uh, entrepreneurs out there it is even tougher with this current COVID situations that is going on around the world so what we want to help in this platform is to promote um, a quick startup programs for young striving entrepreneurs or those entrepreneurs who has gone through hardship of a, you know, jobless or going through a roller coasters in their life, and then they think that they want to sustain a sustainable new business and a, a sustainable incomes, uh, and how to do about it. We will promote, and then we will educate. We will uh, nurture them on how to do a very fast, quick startup investments and then very fast uh, revenue models in this platform. So what we promote mainly is uh, health, because without health, you wouldn't have wealth. And without health, no matter how wealthy you are, you are at a disadvantage. So, and then happiness. Why we have added in happiness rather than others who do well in health only is because without a happy mind, and we cannot uh, achieve uh, good health and uh, our wealth and especially at this time this is very important to take care of our mental health and well-being as well so uh without ado today our speaker is mr kit ho and then we'll be introducing uh about anti-agents and then not only on uh, anti aging as in a persona of uh, outlook but as from wellness from within so mr kit ho has been a meridian expert and in uh, many years, and then he is also advocate of teaching Marinian cell therapies. And then um, also he has a couple of books he has published on his own. And uh, he's a very good speaker for anti-aging and a couple of more things, so which you will discover over the months. And then, uh, yeah, I will invite Kit to come on and then uh, introduce himself a bit more deeper. Kit, are yours? <laughs> Thank you, Gina. Thank you, Gina. So happy to be uh, the speaker to debut on um, this uh, entrepreneurial link. Of course, uh, we have to debut with the best of the first. <laughs> For the first. Okay. Yeah, I'm really happy to uh, bring you this uh, topic, which is very close to my heart. Okay. Uh, and uh, to this topic, you know, I'll be happy to share with you how can you slow down your aging with uh, cutting edge uh, cellular therapy. Okay. Now, my name is Kit, and as what Gina has, uh, has, uh, has introduced me, uh, I've been in the anti-aging field for close to uh, five years now. Uh, I've been helping a lot of people regain good health, with good energy and vitality in the, in the natural manner. So I'm most happy to debut on Entrepreneur Link and share my secrets of uh, how to slow down aging. Now, just a quick, uh, just a quick note. Okay, this presentation today is meant to just provide general information only. It does not recommend or endorse any particular treatment or replace the advice provided by your own medical or health professional. Okay, so from time to time, we may present uh, some real experiences and testimonials. And uh, mind you, a lot of these testimonials are people that I actually know personally. Okay. So let's start proper. Okay, now this uh, this is very Singapore centric. So, but I believe this uh, this is very applicable to uh, many people around the world. Okay, this newspaper article came out in twenty nineteen in the Straits Times. Okay, now it shows a very interesting fact that the number of people who have three or more chronic diseases has easily doubled despite us having you know a top notch medical care. Now, and I I can certainly identify with that. Even my, my brother-in-law himself had a whole bunch of chronic health issues, you know, uh, you name it. Okay? I mean, the top five chronic health that I've actually listed down there, uh, he has at least three or four of them. And then I'm sure many of you kind of realize that, you know, a chronic health issue very seldom occurs on their own. And another very interesting statistic is this. Singaporeans have the honor of really being the country where you live the longest. Now, that's really thanks to our great medical care system. However, what happened is the last 10 to 15 years of that life may not be spent with good quality. Now, personally, my mother-in-law was just like that. Now, she had stroke twice. 
And for the last five years of her life, she was literally bedridden, you know, in a nursing home. Now, when, when, I, when I see her, I thought to myself, well, certainly, you know, this is not the type of quality of life that many of us would look forward to. And of course, from then on, I was kind of like looking for different ways, you know, to, to see how I could actually live life, uh, you know, with quality. And of course, you know, I need not, uh, you know, introduce what this is, right? All of us are very familiar with this, especially with the recent Delta variant, which has proven to be very contagious. And one of the lingering concerns right now is this. If you look at the coronavirus cases right now, it doesn't seem like it's uh, getting any lower. And of course, for those who are in Singapore, you will probably realize that we have just recorded uh, on a daily basis one of the highest number, uh, you know, today. Okay, and you know, uh, worldwide, you know, many countries are not doing any better. Now, one of the main concerns too from COVID is this. You know, I, I saw this newspaper article uh, a couple of days ago, and I thought it's quite uh, interesting to share here. The people who has, uh, you know, suffered uh, COVID, you know, some of them actually have lingering issues, you know, memory loss, and so forth. So there are fears that you know, even people over long term, even after they have healed from. Uh, uh, recovered so-called from COVID, are left with many lingering issues. And it's not just this. You know, this came out in a newspaper that, you know, researchers right now has identified more than 50 long-term effects of COVID itself now. That is indeed uh, pretty, uh, you know, uh, scary statistics, right? Now, let's just look at this picture now. Now, how many of us really look like this, you know, especially if we are mid-30s, uh, mid-40s, or even early 50s, right? we, all, we all look like that. But in actual fact, even though we look like that, we feel like that. You know, I, I know I used to be like that too, right? And this is something that we call premature aging. Now, premature aging is really a very real health issue. It is not just uh, you know, a looks or feeling very tired. In fact, we all know of somebody young, perhaps in their 30s, 40s, and even early 50s who have been affected by one or more of these conditions. I know personally, I have many friends who I was surprised. You know, I thought they were pretty healthy and then I found that many of them has these issues. Now, these are just some of what we call chronic health conditions that we hear of every day. So, well, shall we let's take a quick look at what we call chronic health diseases. Now, the chronic health diseases, this is just what we call the tip of the iceberg, right? Many people think that it's because we have a certain set of conditions, therefore we get affected by a certain health condition. And because we have different set of conditions, therefore we get different sets of disease. Well, think about it. If you look deeper, right? Surely there must be something that's happening within our body, which is giving rise to all this. Now our body system has somehow gone haywire inside and probably over a prolonged period of time, it resulted in us getting many of these chronic health issues. Now, I'm going to, I'm going to share with you a very interesting video. And uh, let's just uh, sit back and watch this uh, video, okay? Now, Amy, can you help me play that uh, wonderful video? Okay, just give us a moment while we pull up the video.
Thank you, thank you, Amin. You know, that has certainly been one of the uh, you know, most interesting video. I never got tired of uh, always watching that video. And I guess you all know what that video is very really all about, right? That video is a video of our body cells. So let me become a biology teacher and take you back a little bit into your biology class. So let's look at the cell. Now, what is a cell? Now, the cell, if you look at it, it's actually the most fundamental building block of the body, okay? Now, it's very interesting because each cell is actually a self-contained living unit and it can actually become modified and specialized to form tissues and organs. And collectively, you know, the whole, all of it forms your entire body. Now, what happens is we will continue to be healthy if all our cells are healthy and continue to function properly. So let's look at some of the important parts of the cell. Now, first, you have what we call the nucleus. Now, the thing of the nucleus as the control center. And inside this control center, it contains all the information that's needed to, for the cells to replicate itself. You know, so that it's like a copy machine, right? It, it takes the formula, it copies itself, and all the formula to make your next cell is actually contained within this nucleus cell. Right? It tells what the cells to do, what to make, and when to reproduce itself. And then, of course, you then have a little peanut-looking thing. Okay, that peanut-looking thing is very important. In fact, that peanut-shaped thing is something what we call a mitochondria. Uh, think about it like the, the power generator for the cells. You know, this is like a power generator. Uh, when the cells take in very good nutrients, then the mitochondria is like a powerhouse and converts them into energy for the cells. And then, of course, there's what we call the cell membrane. Think about the cell membrane is like the fence at your house. Okay, It keeps all the robbers out. So likewise, the cell membranes protect the cells. But it controls what can go in and what can go out of the cell. And in fact, if you look at the cell membrane, it's very interesting. They are like uh, structured proteins, which are, they are proteins and fats, which are actually arranged in a very orderly manner. And what feeds these cells? And what the cells need in order to take in as nutrients to, to be healthy are something what we call microproteins or what we call biopeptides. Okay, biopeptides and forms, but it must be in the form that the cells are able to take in very easily, right? And when the cell, this is what really our stomach does. Our stomach takes in the food, digests them, and then breaking them down. And in the process, convert them into what we call micronutrients that then go into the bloodstream via the small intestines. And this goes to nourish the cells throughout our whole body. Now, what's interesting, if you kind of look at our whole body, they basically comprises of, wow, 100 trillion cells, okay? trillion, not your billion, it's trillion cells. And if you kind of think about it, right, if we have a certain health condition, surely it must be the cell in that part of the body which is not functioning well. So fundamentally, there is really one disease. Okay? And that is of a cell not functioning properly. So of course, depending on what the cell does, for example, if the cells in the heart are not well, then it tends to lead to various types of heart condition. Okay, now that we know that, you know, uh, okay, if it's the cell is not working well, then, you know, it doesn't function well. Let's look at what can make the cells very sick. Now, cells get very sick from two things, okay? One is what we call uh, toxicity. And toxicity means that somehow the cells get poisoned. And the other thing would be what we call deficiency. Now, deficiency just means that, you know, your cells are not getting the nutrients that it, it needs to keep itself healthy. So your cells basically get sick from two things, right? Remember being poisoned, somehow getting poisoned, or doesn't receive the nutrients that it received. So what can be toxic to these cells? Very interesting, right? Toxins to these cells are something called a free radicals. Now let's understand what a free radical actually does. Uh, I, like to use the, uh, I like to use this example. If you think of the healthy cell as a husband and wife that live harmoniously together, and imagine re free radicals as the seductive mistress, okay? That's why in Chinese, sometimes the free radicals are called xiao san, okay? And what these free radicals always aim to do is always look to destabilize the marriage. And how do they do that? They do that by poaching the other people's husband, right? And in the case, de destabilize the marriage. So that's what happens with the free radicals. The free radicals are always trying to make the cells unstable. Now, under normal circumstances, right, our cell membranes are able to withstand all these 
occasional attack. And what happens is very interesting. Our body will produce, let me just go back up. Our body will produce this thing called antioxidant. So you think of antioxidants like all these single men that the, the, the body sent out to marry off all these mistress, right? So if you send all these single men to marry out all these mistress, there's no more mistress left to create haywalk. Of course, your cells are protected, right? So that's why antioxidants are very important because they actually neutralize all the free radicals. Now, however, for some reason, if these free radicals are overwhelming, Wow, guess what? Then they can make their way through the cell walls and penetrate into the cell. And as a result, our cell starts to get damaged. Now let's understand, where do some of these free radicals come from? Whoa, interesting. Yes, life stress and work stress. You know, uh, scientists have discovered that, you know, work stress and life stress, if you, if you live a very stressful lifestyle, it actually gives rise a lot of free radicals in the body. And of course, you know, the pollution around us, you know, be it whether it's the water, the sun, you know, the, the ozone layer, you know, day-to-day, uh, -to -day, these pollutions are also causing a lot of free radicals in our body. And through diet, if you eat unhealthily, and it actually leads to things like smoking, drinking, also gives rise to what we call free radicals. And of course, radiation, okay? Who can forget the whole Fukushima uh, things, right? That happened, there's Chernobyl, and then recently there's Fukushima, and you think that, you know, Fukushima is done? Well, think again, you know, uh, you know there's still uh, radiated water being discharged into the sea, just that, you know, the thing that is all diluted by the sea, nothing happens. But really, all these are sources of free radicals and of course, medicine that we take, right? We are getting to be a society where we are very dependent on various medicine to treat our health condition. And of course, not forgetting, right? What is this? Our phones, our Wi-Fi, our routers, right? We're all clamoring for more Gs. Okay, 3G, 4G, 5G, and uh, pretty soon 6G is coming. We want speed. We want to see our movies seamlessly. But you know that it comes with a high price to pay. In fact, scientists have discovered that, you know, the heavier intensity of the radiation, right? If you constantly bombard it, especially if you hold it right against your ears and so forth, you know, they, they did studies on mice. It shows that the radiation has the possibility to affect blood vessels. Okay, so that's how, you know, if you think that radiation is pretty safe, you know, you can think again, you know. Of course, we are saying that why are these free radicals so harmful, right? Now, this is really the reason. If the free radicals manage to get through the walls, guess what it starts to attack, right? It can make, if it starts to attack the peanut-shaped thing called a mitochondria, remember, that's the powerhouse, then you feel constantly tired, right? Despite no much how much rest you get, you always feel very tired. Now, if the nucleus gets attacked, right? And remember, in the nucleus itself, the, it contains all the DNA or all the instructions for the cells to make new cells. So if your, if your DNA starts getting damaged, guess what? The next cell that it makes is going to be slightly weaker than the cells before. And if this goes on longer and longer, there are a lot of things starts happening. In fact, things like this, right? You might find that your good genes get turned off. And what do you mean by good genes? So things like our metabolism rate, you know, and digestion rate, also our hormonal system, right? All these are actually governed by, by genes in the body. And these good genes might get turned off. And guess what? Sometimes bad genes get turned on. You know, you, you, you know of people who, you know, thought they were very healthy and then wow. You know, suddenly, you know, you realize they have things like cancer, they have things like uh, fibromyalgia, and you're kind of wondering what's happening. Well, could it be because the bad genes got turned on without them even realizing it? And of course, you know, it leads to stuff like a uh, telomere shortening. It leads to things like apoptosis. Now, apoptosis is a very interesting mechanism. It's, it's what we call automatic cell death. You know, it's when the cells detect that, you know, something unusual happens to it. It's supposed to commit suicide. And when, if it forgets how to commit suicide when it goes, uh, you know, mutated, guess what? It starts to proliferate unstoppably. And in fact, you know, that's really what cancer is all about. Now, of course, we look at it when the cells get damaged, what does the body do? Now, when the cells get damaged, it's interesting because the cells will start to repair itself uh, automatically, right? I mean, the, the cells are very, very smart. You know, when I get damaged, I of course start repairing myself. And during this, what we call the cellular repair process, it evokes a process called inflammation. 
And inflammation, you know, uh, in a controlled manner is actually a good thing. Of course, when the repair is completed in the cells, the inflammation stops. The problem is when the body is under constant attack and the cells are perpetually repairing itself, you know, time after time, before it's the time to repair itself, it gets attacked again, okay? And this leads to something that we call oxidative stress. And this is what then caused all the cells to be under what we call chronic inflammation. And of course, scientists have discovered that, you know, chronic inflammation and also oxidative stress, they have been known to be the root cause of many chronic diseases. So if you look at some of these diseases and you find that, you know, you're constantly sometimes in pain and stuff like that, you know, you want to kind of start wondering whether is it because your body is under constant inflammation? And what happens if you're under, you know, constant oxidative stress? It can affect a lot of these things. In fact, scientists have found out that uh, easily more than 90 diseases are still counting, you know, our results, are direct result of what they call oxidative stress. So now let me introduce you then, you know, to this uh, wonderful thing, the transformative power away called cell therapy. Yeah. Now cell therapy is really not something very new. In fact, the father of cell therapy is really this gentleman that you see on the slide. He's called Dr. Paul Nihans from uh, Switzerland. Now, even till today, one of the most famous anti-aging clinic in Switzerland is actually named the clinic Paul Nihans. And he has a very famous line that I really like. You know, he says, what I'm just striving to do is not to give more years to life, meaning, you know, I'm, I'm not talking about just prolonging your life, but to give more life to years. And it means the quality of life that we live as we age. And you guess what? Dr. Paul Nihans is famous because he has treated many famous film stars, including the Pope, including people like Marilyn Monroe, and people like Charlie Chaplin, right? They have all, you know, at one time or other undergone cellular treatment in Switzerland. So what really is cell therapy? Now, uh, in a very simplified explanation, a proper cell therapy must first be able to intercept and prevent the cell from being further damaged. Of course, I agree with that, right? The, the free radicals are attacking the cell. So you must have a way of preventing the cells from being uh, further damaged, right? Then after that, you know, the, the therapy must be able to help the cells to repair and maintain themselves. And finally, you know, after, you know, all the maintenance is done, the repair is done, Hey, guess what? It's able to rebuild and rejuvenate your, itself. Of course, it's not possible to reverse your aging completely, but then it is very possible to slow down your aging and help improve many types of chronic health condition. Now, let's look at what do the rich and famous do. Now, some of you might recognize some familiar faces there, like maybe Andy Lau, you know, Aaron Kwok too, right? So what do the rich and famous do? Well, you know, they can afford it. They fly themselves all the way to countries like Switzerland to get their cell therapy treatment. And of course, depending on which clinic they go to, it can cost anywhere from uh, US 50K to about 100K per treatment session. And you actually have to do it annually to sustain the results. Okay, let's look a little bit in depth. At what are the different cell therapies available? Now, at the very top, okay, is something which is actually called stem cell by implantation. Now, in cell cell, cell by implantation, the doctors actually take your stem cells from uh, the fast tissue or what they call adipose tissue or maybe the bone marrow, right? And then they process them, they activate the stem cells and then they pump it back to you by injection. And typically it's actually injected into areas where, you know, uh, the damage happened. And then, you know, the, the stem cells will, will go there and, you know, help to repair the area. And of course, more common is something called cell therapy by injectables or what you call stem cell rejuvenation. Now, this is really where all the rich and famous go to Switzerland. So what do they do? So in those clinics, you know, they, they, they use this to combat the effects of natural aging process. Now, in this clinic, a large amount of what we call youthful stem cells, they can be extracted from either sheep or human placenta. They are then injected into the body. That's why it has to be uh, handled by doctors and trained nurses uh, because it's, it's really a hospital procedure. And these youthful cells are intended to go into the body and replace all the old cells, thus allowing the body to work, work more efficiently by healing itself and also reducing the inflammation. Then about 13 to 14 years ago, I would say roughly about that, 
cell therapy in the form of oral supplements started coming out in the market. Now, I'll say that many are extracted from uh, different animal placenta. You know, I've known of like sheep, horse, deer, pigs, and, and even goats, right? But for now, I will just focus on those that is extracted from what we call marine cells, and I will explain later on. Right? Okay, here I will stop and I will just let uh, Dr. Joan Ramos explain to you what is the secrets of uh, anti-aging. Okay, so uh, Amin, can you help me play, uh, play the video? So what is Cellergen and what does it contain? Oh, great subject. Cellergen is a oral cell therapy from marine origin. It's the first oral cell therapy that comes from marine species, specifically from salmon and herring. The Swiss have had for many years sheep placenta injections that have fantastic effects on vitality, on rejuvenation, on energy, on mood, and they were never allowed in the United States. But now they figured out a way to create the same effect, extracting DNA from marine species and putting them in an oral form, and they created Cellergen. Cellergen is the first therapy, oral therapy, comes from cells of marine species that has a phenomenal effect on energy, vitality, mood, and regeneration. My business card, what I do is wellness and regenerative medicine. I regenerate tissues, and this is the first, the best tool I have for that. The effect it has on my patients is phenomenal. They're just loving it, they're loving it. I wanna feel great too, yeah. Especially the effects of mood, it's great. It's one of the first things they feel. Wow, I feel great. Then is the feeling of well-being, is the vitality, is the energy. Then you have, as time goes by, you feel greater muscle strength, stamina, exercise uh, resistance. And basically it's one of the best tools I have for improving well-being. Why should people use Cellergen? Cellergen contains DNA, DNA of marine origin. And it's extracted using a cold technique that preserves the intact form of DNA. If you heat protein, it loses a lot of its structure and therefore its power. And that's how all protein is extracted using heat. This is the first time the protein is extracted using a cold method that preserves the full structure and intensity and power and efficacy of the protein. And being very small protein from these very small cells and these very small animals, it penetrates the brain very quickly. So one of the first things you're gonna feel is improvement in mood. And then it's improvement in energy. It also has protein that helps regenerate cartilage and skin. 90% of it is DNA. The other 10% is these other peptides that help with skin, cartilage, uh, and the like. Everybody wants to feel great. If you want to feel great and take your life and your enjoyment and your youth and, and your vitality to the next level, you should take Cellergen. Everyone should take Cellergen because anytime that you are regenerating your tissues, you're sort of counteracting the effects of aging. So aging process slows down and everything improves and you fend off disease. So anything that helps you live free of illness, free of pain, that's what you want. Cellergen provides that. What benefits does Cellergen have? Cellergen has a lot of benefits. We believe at the Wellness Institute of the Americas that when we provide you with the proper nutrients, nutraceuticals, natural supplements, hormones, proper food, proper exercise, proper sleep hygiene, that you are going to be at the top of your game. And the most important tool I have right now, Cellergen, to accomplish that. How long does it take to see results from Cellergen? You can see results very quickly. It depends on how bad you feel. You feel bad, you can see results in two or three days. If you feel great, it may take longer. What is cell therapy? 
Cell therapy is a therapy that is based on things extracted from cells. Like blood transfusion is cell therapy. Grafts are cell therapy. This is something extracted from live cells. That's why we call it cell therapy. Thank you so much for talking to us, Dr. Ramos. It was really a pleasure. Well, thank you, Dr. Ramos. Okay, that was uh, certainly a uh, most interesting, uh, you know, a most interesting uh, sharing from him. Okay, that's Dr. John Ramos. Okay, uh, in fact, if you go and check him up, he is a very famous uh, anti aging uh, anti aging uh, doctor in uh, in US. You know, he runs his own wellness institute and so forth. So let's carry on. So what what was that he was actually describing? He was actually describing the use of salicin. So what is actually in salicin? Um, there's only five uh, six main ingredients inside salicin. Okay, are uh, all natural. Um, and the most key ones that you want to take note of is the first three, what we call the bio-DNA complex, the, the peptide collagen, and the hydro peptide. And what does these things actually uh, help with? Okay, I will share with you later. Now, then why is selogen so effective? You know, in fact, what happened in selogen itself, right? It is actually uh, live fish DNA, you know, encapsulated. And this, this DNA is actually extracted from fish, you know, wild-caught fish off the deep seas of France. And you know, the batch or any batch of fish that is actually caught has to be certified to be free of contaminants and of the highest standard before it's actually sent all the way to Switzerland for processing. And why Switzerland? It's really because of the technology. Okay, they, as what Dr. Ramos explained, the cold process technology to extract the uh, you know the potent biopeptides is what actually ensures that you know the, the, the fish DNAs are still alive. Okay. And also the, the, the way that salicin is, uh, is, is designed, is designed to bypass your stomach. And also the capsule, which is actually made of fish skin, is actually uh, designed to bypass the stomach and dissolves only in the small intestine, in which case after that, when the active ingredients get released, it goes very quickly into the bloodstream and then you know, goes throughout the whole body. Now, to me, one of the most interesting things you will notice is this, okay? Uh, if you if you go and just Google up and look at independent clinical studies, okay, the independent clinical studies for salicin, in fact, is conducted by what we call biohistory. Biohistory is one of Europe's largest independent test labs, and it produces all sorts of test reports. And then you know, eventually, uh, body to scan the QR code on the right hand side, it will lead you to all the clinical studies that's been done on salicin to ensure that you know they understand what are the effects. So it includes effects like you know, uh, energy, you know, rebuilding of bones, uh, you know, pain management, and so forth. There are many clinical studies that actually being done on salicin to validate that you know it has the effect that is uh you know reputed to and more important is this thing right you know, when it comes to cell therapy because cells it can it has the ability to go into the body to affect your cells to me quality and safety is a paramount okay in fact if you kind of look at the uh salicin itself it has more than uh, 35 to 40 lab different lab accreditations right ranging from, you know, the, the, you know, good manufacturing practices to, you know, in Switzerland. So one of the most uh, pride uh, accreditation is, you know, on the top left-hand side, you will see the cross there. You know, that means that, you know, this uh, salicin is not only just manufactured in Switzerland, it is also saleable in Switzerland. In fact, some anti-aging clinics, like they use it to supplement their, their treatment, right, for the, for the patients. And of course, the other more pride on is all the way to the right hand side is what we call a BSCG cert. A BSCG cert is a what we call banned substance control group certificate. And why is that so prized? Because for athletes who are looking to compete at the highest level, you know, they must be sure that whatever they consume, you know, do not contain any uh, hormones or or you know any any chemicals. So for all these all these uh, supplements that they consume for athletes, they must be ensured that it has a BSCG certified drug free cert. You know, and how stringent is this cert, right? Uh, what happened is it's not a certificate that you get one time and that's it. For every lot of manufactured uh, supplements, you actually have to send uh, samples into the BSCG cert to validate that uh, you know it's drug free before you're allowed to continue putting the BSCG cert onto the uh, item itself. Now let's look at uh, what are these. These are 
all remember all the ingredients that were in selogen from the bio DNA to the peptides and so forth. Now, these are what we call super antioxidants. Now, these are really super antioxidant at a very cellular level, which means it's able to help protect yourself right at the cellular level and neutralize a lot of these free radicals. So remember what I said about cell therapy, it must have the ability to protect the, uh, the cells. And this is what happens, right? All these uh, ingredients are super antioxidant. Now let's look at the bio-DNA cellular membrane complex itself. Now this is really the, one of the key ingredients that, uh, that of why cellogen is so uh, potent. Okay? Now the bio-DNA cellular membrane complex can improve, well, not just your vitality and stamina, it helps to relieve joint pain. So for a lot of people who has you know, arthritic joint pain and stuff like that, you know, when they take cellogen, it feels that you know, it helps them to reduce with the inflammation and it improves sports performance and recovery. Now, again, very important thing, it also helps to restore your immune cell and accelerates healing. Now, let's just look at some of the people. This is really my friend, right, uh, um, Nelly. Now, um, Nelly thought this was the best photo because it was taken on holiday and she was with uh, her two sons. And this is uh, Nelly after taking Cellogen for three years. And, you know, that's me with her. And what she found was, of course, the physical looks improved, the energy level increased, and more important, it helped with her sleep quality, you know, because she was reaching age where, you know, she was, uh, you know, getting a lot of insomnia and, you know, Cellogen really helped her to resolve her insomnia issues. Okay. Now, this is one of my uh, partner in uh, Thailand. He's actually an athletic doctor himself, you know, he's Dr. K, okay. And this is what happened when she first took uh, Cellogen. She actually experienced uh, hair growth, you know, on her morning patches. And she did a very detailed study, you know, there was the, during the phase where she was actually uh, and um, evaluating Cellogen. She found that Cellogen helped, you know, him to kind of uh, improve his physical appearances. He found that his wounds somehow are also, uh, you know, healing faster and he looks better. And, you know, within that short span of time, he found that, you know, his physical looks grow better, his hair grew back. And of course, he found that, you know, even his uh, good cholesterol was actually improving. Now, I know Han Yong. Han Yong actually works in, in, a, in a hospital and Han Yong started Cellogen in 2018. Now, back then when she first came in to take Cellogen, we didn't know that he had, well, that many issues. You know, the reason he started on Cellogen was because he had a hip pain and he was looking for a solution for it. And he was introduced by one of his ex-colleagues uh, to take Cellogen. And of course, you know, when you took it, it helped him to improve the pain, but we didn't realize, you know, how much he improved until he came back, uh, you know, a couple of months later, he was really happy and we said, you know, what happened? So then he was telling us that, you know, wow, you know, do you realize that I didn't even realize that, you know, uh, Stalagen was helping me to improve many things in many of my areas. And he was really happy over the fact that, you know, Stalagen has that potency to help him. And of course, this is uh, Mr. Tan. Mr. Tan actually was a diabetic. And uh, before Cellogen, uh, you know, this was his condition of his leg. But Mr. Tan was adamant that he didn't want to have his leg amputated because that was what the doctor was recommended. He said, I'd rather lose my life than, you know, go around without a leg. So, you know, luckily a friend recommended him Cellogen and then he, uh, he, he took it and he started realizing that it helped him to improve his, uh, his, uh, his leg condition after a year. So on the right hand side, you see him that was after two years and he happened to be in, he's an Indonesian, he happened to be in Singapore visiting and he came to office to kind of thank, uh, thank us, you know, for what Cellogen has brought him. Lah, okay. And yeah, that's after one year, his legs. Okay. And more interesting, remember I thought about accelerated healing. This is the sister of one of my friends. He actually has a fracture. And you know that, especially for old folks, right? You know, if you fracture your arm, it always take a long time to heal, right? Because at that age, you know, even the healing is uh, takes a long time. And so, of course, you know, Lily started on uh, two soft gels daily and you realize that, you know, less than about what, one and a half months. Wow, he, you know, you can actually see the bone uh, started healing. And more important, you know, after that, he was actually back to her cooking, you know, in less than four to five weeks time. And, you know, for somebody of that age, uh, this type of healing is actually uh, very welcome. Now, the rest of the ingredients uh, include what we call rabbit straw in, uh, in the uh, in cellogen. Now, a lot of you might think that, you know, hey, I also take rabbit straw, you know, I think it's a separate, uh, you know, as a separate uh, supplement by itself. But when all these ingredients are synergistically blended okay, together with the biomarino, the effect is really very different. Okay? 
And of course, inside it also has coenzyme Q10, which again, I know people say that, you know, I do take coenzyme Q10 supplement just by itself. Again, remember why I say that, you know, when it's all blended in together, you know, the effects are um, pretty amazing. Now, in fact, this is one of my friends. This is Don. Okay, Don at that time was age 70. He was retired. He was a very uh, well-known consultant. And what happened is Don has a weak, uh, weak heart valve. And doctors were telling him that, you know, uh, if Don, you know, uh, you know, in four or five weeks time, you know, ask him to come back to do another round of tests again. And if he didn't pass his test, you know, they were going to put him under the table for surgery. Now, Don was kind of, uh, you know, scared of that because he had a friend with similar issues, went in, uh, didn't come out at all. So he was looking for a solution. And luckily he met, uh, you know, a good friend, uh, Elvin. That's Elvin on the top left-hand side, also my good friend. And then Elvin recommended that he started on Celogen. Okay, so that's when uh, Don, you know, uh, started on Celogen. And guess what, you know, uh, in a month's time when he went back to see the doctor, doctor realized that his uh, situation has stabilized. So doctor said, okay, since it's kind of stabilized, I think we can hold off the surgery for a while. Let's, let's come back in three months time and see what happens. Well, of course, to cut a long story short, you know, Don went, end up going on his, uh, his world tour, okay? And then, you know, uh, you know, three years from now, three years from then when this thing happened, uh, guess what? His heart wound started repairing and then the heart, which was original and large, has slowly grown back to its uh, normal size. And so right now, you know, Don is really, you know, uh, if he sees anybody, he always shares with them what uh, Celigen could do to improve their quality of life. And this is my friend who's a doctor in uh, Philippines. That's Dr. Diona. Dr. Diona's mother is actually an attorney, okay, a very famous attorney in uh, Philippines. And of course, the, the mom actually has, uh, again, you know, was diagnosed as having congestive heart failure. And doctor says, you know, they, there's only so much they can do and ask uh, Dr. Diona to bring the mother home, you know, to recuperate. And of course, Dr. Diona, you know, thanks to a good friend, Gina, who recommended him, recommended her Celogen. She started giving the mom Celogen. And she actually noticed that within a week of that, right, the mom started regaining her strength and able to walk to the toilet herself. Well, and in less than one month's time, her mom actually went on stage to receive her lifetime award, right? Now, the other good thing is the mom used to be on a whole big cocktail of medicine and she was able to reduce about one third of his medicine after, you know, starting on Celogen. And in fact, uh, Dr. Diona is such a, you know, a, a convert that, you know, in, in Philippines right now, he's one of the doctors that pioneer the use of this uh, cell therapy uh, in oral form to help many of his patients. Now, inside salad itself also has what we call hydro peptide and hydro peptide And this is very important, especially for those of you who are, you know, having uh, worn-out joints, worn-out cartilage, right? They're both the hydro peptide or what we call them. And what does this have the effect of doing? Okay, hydro peptide has the ability to reduce glycemic index, which is good news for a diabetic patient, right? Uh, because, you know, whatever food that you take in, you know, uh, less of it is converted into sugar. And hydro peptide also, you know, allows, uh, you know, allows many good effects. And one of it would be this, right? This is uh, another of my friend, Nasi. Nasi started on Celogen back then at the recommendation of her sister. And, you know, back then, uh, Nasi has a lot of joint problems, okay? She couldn't walk properly. Uh, her sleep, his sleep was often affected and so forth. So he actually started Celogen. And, you know, in a very short period of time, he realized that, wow, he was actually experiencing the, the good benefit of it. And from then on, he even went on his uh, Mecca and then, you know, because he was so happy away, you know, actually in his 10th anniversary, he actually volunteered to perform in, uh, in you know, in, in our show. So that's Narsi, okay? And of course, inside has lutein. And lutein, some of you also knows that it's really good for the eyes. And I know some of you will say that I've also taken lutein uh, supplements, but you know, when lutein is again blended synergistically, there is many good effects. This is the mother of one of my close friends, uh, Tengi uh, from Myanmar. And her mom actually has cataract and she, want, he, she was using a lot of eye drops to drip onto her eyes, uh, not constantly because of the cataract. And after he started on Celogen, you know, when the repairs are happening, she realized that, oh, no, I need to use less and drops eye drops. In fact, there are many people with uh, cataract issues that has really benefited from using uh, using this. Okay. And this is, uh, again, one of my friend, Nancy. 
uh, this was Nancy was very interesting because Nancy was what we actually call a supplement queen. Okay, Nancy used to take a big cocktail of supplements. And but then she was kind of feeling very bloated and uh, not feeling very, you know, even with all these supplements and, you know, doc was telling her that, well, we, we couldn't really find anything wrong, wrong with you. But yet, you know, she wasn't feeling very, uh, you know, at ease. And then after Nancy got introduced to Stelogen by her good friend, Wendy, you know, and this is the effect after she started taking, you realize that the face slimmed down. Now, not so much as because it's a slimming uh, thing, it's because she has a lot of water retention, a lot of uh, stuff, uh, you know, congested in the lymphatic system. So, you know, Stelogen helped him, help her to uh, detox. And this is Nancy at 64 years old. And she definitely looked a lot better than when she was like, you know, uh, when she first started taking. In fact, you know, uh, I was on a trip with her about two years ago uh, to Thailand. And then, you know, we were happily shopping and she really doesn't look like a 64 year old. Okay. Now this is Madam Yo. Okay, Madam Yo was actually introduced to take Stelogen by her daughter Chun Gyok. Okay, and it was because Chun Gyok experienced the, the goodness of Stelogen and decided that you know her mom should take it. And that time, you know, Madam Yo was looked like that. And look at Madam Yo after two months on Stelogen. Okay, you will realize that you know it's not just about the thing, right? It's about the energy and the radiance that seems to have gone back uh, to her, her face. Two months on that. And this is her after two years on Salogen, okay? I still remember meeting her about two years ago at our 10th anniversary. And, you know, she really, you know, doesn't look like she's like a 90, old, 90 year old. You know, she was still walking herself and she was happily, uh, you know, happily enjoying the show. And then, of course, you know, a lot of people recognize her and we we're like all taking photos with her. And that's actually uh, Madam Yo. Uh, this is another good friend of mine, Maria. And Maria, uh, for her, you know, she was because she was hitting the menopausal age, and you realize one of the dangers of menopausal age was osteoporosis starts setting in. And this was what's happening. She actually realized the bone density was actually getting uh, you know, to heading towards the dangerous zone. And you know, when she started on Salogen back then, you know, um, we didn't realize that it could help with bones because you know, those were the early years when Salogen first started coming out. But, you know, to her, you know, to her delight, you know, uh, Maria realized that after a year on Salogen, you know, her, her bone density was increasing back. And in fact, that's one of the benefits that we actually realized right now that, you know, uh, taking Salogen actually helps a lot with the bones and, you know, uh, things like osteoporosis, okay? And this is David, you know, I met him uh, in, uh, in the office and, you know, he has the uh, same thing. Like many of us, some of us, you know, when we're young, we play all these active sports. So he was playing squash, playing football, playing rugby, you name it. And of course, you know, the knee was all worn out. And uh, again, you know, a, a good friend recommended and he started on it. And then slowly, Stelogen helped his, uh, his joints. Uh, first of all, relieve the pain. And of course, it helps to repair the joints. And he's starting to go back to jog again. And then, of course, it also helped him with his uh, insomnia issue. Now, next thing is actually a very interesting question I get all the time, right? Is cell therapy suitable for cancer? Okay. Well, I would just mention here that, you know, uh, especially for patients who's undergoing, uh, you know, who, who have cancer or even uh, hormonal issues, you want to be careful about taking things which may have uh, hormones because doctors will discourage strongly against it. And that is really why a BSCG cert is uh, so priced here because the BSCG cert will ensure you that, you no. Know, this thing doesn't have any hormones. Now, I would say cell therapy is not a cure, okay? But cell therapy can be very complementary to, uh, you know, to help a patient undergo when they're undergoing cancer treatment. Uh, so this was something that we discovered in the very early years uh, when Salogen first came out. We realized that, you know, cancer patients, when they were taking it, you know, seemed to uh, weather their treatment better and they were, their, their health was improving and their energy level was high. But then we always have this question, right? You know, wow, you know, if cellulite is so good for cells, you know, does that mean since cancer, wouldn't cancer cells like, wow, take in the cellulite and grow even faster? So what, what, what we did then was uh, after three or four years into the, the, the life of uh, 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 cellulite, we actually sent cellulite in for, uh, to do clinical lab testing to really understand why is that, that, you know, when cancer patients were taking cellulite, it was so useful for them. And as a result, uh, well, go Google it up, okay? I mean, the, the, the whole paper is actually written on, you know, the effects of cellulite, you know, on various cancer uh, cells. 
So it was tested under lab condition on both uh, liver cancer cells and pancreatic cancer cells because those two are some of the most uh, prevalent. And this is very interesting because what it realized that in the presence of uh, selogen, it actually helps to slow down you know, the, the growth of uh, you know, some of the liver cancer cells. And this is good news, right? Because many people undergo uh, chemo treatment. And what does the chemo treatment do? The chemo treatment will go in and supposed to bombard you know, all the cancer cells and hopefully you know, destroy all the cancer cells. And of course, what happened in the process of it, right? It also affects some of their normal cells. That's why a lot of time uh, for cancer patients, the immune system is uh, affected quite a fair bit. Now, this is also good news because it certainly can help to slow down the growth of some of these cancer cells. It also gives the chemotherapy a better chance of, you know, doing its job of, you know, getting, uh, getting rid of the cancer cells before they kind of, uh, you know, proliferate beyond, uh, uh, beyond, you know, beyond stoppage. And this is also what they were doing. So we're running a lot of tests and these are just some of the scientific research, you know, to, to, to summarize it all up, you know, what happened is they actually found that, you know, cellular not only slows down the growth of some of these cancer cells, but very interesting, right? Uh, is able to help the cells regain their ability for apoptosis. You remember what I said about apoptosis is a natural phenomenon of our own cells where when you discover that it's abnormal, it actually commits suicide. And then you can say like cancer cells are cells that forget to commit suicide, like you know when they are abnormal. And what happened in the presence of cellogen is they able to stimulate a lot of these cells to regain their ability to apoptosis. Okay, so the cell remembers that wow, I'm supposed to die if I'm abnormal. So it helps to you know uh, promote greater apoptosis, and that actually good. That is actually good news. Now these are some of the other uh, you know effects that's found. That cellogen actually suppresses some of the proteins that actually encourages the growth of uh, of cancer. So I'll move quickly through this because, you know, and of course, selogen uh, also was found to decrease, you know, what we call the activity or what we call a proto-oncogenic uh, thing. And why is that so? Because these are some of the cancer that are actually driven by this thing called the CMYC oncogene. Okay. In fact, you can look at, you know, it ranks among some of the top cancers that are listed down there. And of course, we also did our uh, test on pancreatic cancer cells and we actually found that, you know, with low invasive uh, cancer cells, it, it still remains invasive, but of course it's low invasiveness. But what was interesting with the high invasive cancer cells, right, it actually becomes less invasive. And this again become very important because you don't want the cancer cells to grow very rapidly until the treatments can't handle it. And these are just some of the test results, you know, by all means, go check it out now. In summary, what does that do? This is really Amy, okay? Amy, back in 2015, was discovered that she had, had breast cancer uh, of the most severe kind. So besides having the mastectomy, Amy actually has to undergo 14 rounds of uh, chemo and radiotherapy treatment, okay? And you, as you all know that um, the treatments are very uh, very detrimental to the body. In fact, for why, why is that fingernail thing so significant about the pinkish nail, right? For some of you who might have friends who have uh, undergone radiotherapy treatment, if you kind of look at their skin and also look at some of their fingernails, right? They always look on a darkish, uh, you know, very dark color because literally the, the radiotherapy treatment is burning you up from the inside. And, you know, uh, at that time, Amy didn't realize the significance of it. You know, she actually, uh, she actually, her doctor actually told her that, wow, you know, hey, Amy, you look really good, you know. And she, you know, and, and she said, why? You know, you look, all my patients, right, after they undergone so many treatment, usually by the time your fingers are all blackish, but look at you. You actually look like in the pink of hell, aside from the loss of hair, you know, everything is normal. And guess what? You know, of course, when uh, everything was uh, in remission, uh, um, Amy continued to take selogen. And you notice one thing, right? Actually, you know, you, you look like Amy, right? She seems to be frozen in age. And that's really what selogen does. It really slows down your aging where, you know, you kind of remain and look the same as you are. Uh, of course, this is Ida. Ida was an Indonesian that actually came to uh, Indonesia for uh, came to Singapore for treatment. And a friend recommended her. And because she was a socialite, Right. Uh, so when she came here, she was really weak and so forth. And then when somebody recommended her salogen, you know, she was a skeptic. You know, of course, I don't blame her. 
But she listened enough and she decided that she was going to buy a box bag and she took a box bag all the way to Indonesia. And within two weeks of taking it, she actually felt the energy coming back. And that was very important because, you know, uh, you need energy to make sure that you, uh, your body can heal properly. And of course, uh, you know, to cut a long story short, you know, uh, her, her cancer went into remission. She continued taking Celagen and, you know, she, she restored so much of her energy that she actually went uh, for a second marriage and remarried again. <laughs> okay. Now, what else can Celagen do? Some of you might ask, okay. Enhance the immunity cells. Now, this is very important, okay. Some of the immune, natural immune cells in a white body cells are this thing called macrophage and a natural killer cell. And why do we say that? Because, you know, because when we were wanting to get a uh, cellulogen into China, we actually, the, the China lab tested, you know, more than a couple hundred boxes of cellulogen. And this is really the result of what the lab test says, okay? It actually shows that cellulogen enhances the activity of both the macrophage and the NK cells, you know? Now, maybe two or three years before then, you know, this may not have seemed like an important thing, you know, say, oh, immunity is, is good. But, you know, in recent time, you know, what we found that over the last two years, you know, people who have been taking Celagen, you know, first Celagen was helping those who uh, contracted COVID um, to recover very quickly with very minimal effect. And what this was uh, one of the uh, our friend in Indonesia, Pak Henry, you know, uh, the, both the the husband, both the husband and the wife, you know, uh, and you notice their condition, they have all the diabetics, you know, they, they were in a high risk thing. But actually, you know, short of the fact that, you know, when the doctors checked them, was surprised that, you know, hey, they were coping so well that they didn't even go to the hospital, they actually recovered at home and they actually recovered very quickly. And Christopher on the left-hand side is the brother of a Singapore friend of mine. And then Christopher actually got COVID when he's in New York. And, you know, the sister upon hearing it, you know, got two boxes sent all the way to US, you know, and then when he received it and he was taking it and, you know, he actually recovered fairly quickly. Remember what I said about, you know, uh, COVID possibly having long-term effect, you know, on strength, on anything. So it was important that, you know, even with COVID, you are able to recover back to your old self pretty quickly. And in Philippines, especially last year, we have a lot of uh, people, doctors and so forth, you know, who are actually taking uh, Celagen to help them uh, recover from their COVID uh, very quickly and also to boost and strengthen up their immune system. Okay. Uh, yes, you know, uh, if you go and uh, do some of the research, I say Dr. David Minkoff, he's a very famous doctor who actually runs a live work wellness center. Uh, they are, they're quite well known for using Celagen in a lot of the, uh, their, their treatments to help their patients. And he actually found that, you know, some of his patients who had uh, Parkinson, you know, actually improved after taking Celagen. And on the right-hand side, there's actually a doctor friend of uh, one of my Myanmar uh, uh, friends here, who also, you know, the uncle, you know, has Parkinson, and then they actually gave him uh, Parkinson to take. Uh, this is my friend, Hui Kun. Uh, Hui Kun has lupus. And for those who actually know what lupus is, like lupus is actually an uh, autoimmune disease. You know, your body decides to turn against you and attack your joints. So she was in constant pain. So when Celagen first came out, you know, she was one of the very first uh, users of uh, Celagen. And she found that within two months, you know, her, her symptoms and her pain was reduced tremendously. And that was a uh, really a benefit. Today, if you see her go when she's dancing and so forth, you wouldn't have realized that she was a lupus patient. Okay. Now here, I would uh, like the admin to play a video. I'll stop sharing. This is a very interesting story of a good friend of mine, uh, Anga and his wife, uh, Ollie. Okay. Let me just stop share. Okay. I mean, can you help me play the video? Hello, I am Anga and this is my wife Oli from our marriage. We have two wonderful sons. Uh, it has been a good life for us then. However, things turned out the other way. When Oli fell ill in 1995, we visited almost every hospital in Jakarta at that time. Doctors could not explain us the cause of the disease. Oli's body would ache extremely. She begins to lose her vision, her hearing. The worst thing is she lost her sense of touch. Uh, I went wanting the best for her. We seek 
uh, medical help in Singapore and there we know the name of the disease is fibromyalgia. Doctors until today do not know the cause of this disease and the cure to it. At that time we did not give up. We went as far as Shanghai and Guangzhou to seek for medical help. Her life was fading and all she could do was lying in bed for 15 years. Okay. All his arms and legs, I remember, would get skinny and feeble. She could hardly pick up a cup, let alone walk. Her future looks grim. Her vision became blurry. Her words became indistinct as she could not pronounce words properly. Her once warm attitude towards me turned cold because she could not feel my hug. I like combing her beautiful hair, but then she could not feel me combing her hair. Every day she could cry, so did my heart. She felt hopeless, so was I. Yes, so, so was I. In 2013, on the business trip, I came here to Avita, but it was close. It's a Hari Raya, and I came back on the next day. Again, it was close. It was National Singapore National Day, but then I made the third, made it the third time on Saturday, and there, then I met uh, Joey, who helped me a lot, welcomed me, explained me about Cellergen comprehensively. In doubt, I returned to my hotel to look and search more about this product. To my surprise, I found a doctor whom who suffered the same disease as my wife and has benefited from Cellergen. Now, this is the miraculous part that uh, I came back to Avita to purchase two boxes of Cellergen for my wife. Within two months of consuming Cellergen, all these conditions uh, showed improvement. She regained back her vitality, her energy, and she told me she felt like a new life um, grew within her. One day while at work, Oli called me from upstairs in our house. She told me she walked up the stairs on her own. This is the first time in 15 years she could walk up the stairs on her own. I was amazed that evening we embraced each other. We were grateful. We cried in joy. Thank you, Seller Jen. Thank you, Avita. Okay, let me just, uh, oops. Uh, sorry, hang on for a while. Okay, let me just share my screen again. Well, I know both Anga and Oli are very, uh, you know, uh, very close friends of mine. You know, I, I see them every time when they come to uh, Singapore. And you know, I've never failed and in fact I was there when they actually made that uh video uh video itself. Okay. So yeah, uh very touching on what uh Saladin has done to actually bring uh life back to uh Oli. Okay. Okay, let me move on then to the uh next screen. Now, this is actually uh Mao Mao. You know, Mao Mao's husband actually suffered a very serious uh 
stroke. Okay, so let me again. I will just uh, stop share. And I'll get the. Uh, I'll get the. Uh, uh, I mean, can you help me to play the next video? Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you, I mean, for in that video. Okay, so again, Mao Mao is actually one of my, uh, you know, oops. Okay, uh, Mao Mao is again one of my close friends. Uh, so really very happy to uh, be able to, you know, see her and her husband actually uh, recovered. You know, and then of course it's not only totally recover. Every time she has a small little victories, you know, we all cheer for her because you know we we, we know how what 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 how tough it has been. Okay, now just to move on, you know, this is with illegal for some of you who know that's like the uh, Michael Jackson uh, Michael Jackson disease. Okay, where you know, and this is actually a form of autoimmune disease, and this is actually Ming Hao, and then Ming Hao actually you know uh, after taking. Uh, uh, find that his uh, vitiligo condition uh, gradually improved. This was him actually appearing on stage about two years ago, sharing his story of uh, how Selagen has actually helped him. And for some of you who actually recognize the lady on there, that's actually Jing Ying Jie. Okay, Jing Ying Jie, you know, uh, was a very close friend of uh, our CEO. And what happened is our CEO noticed that, you know, her, her, her mood was not quite right. And so what happened is she actually, you know, managed to persuade Jing Ying Jie to start on Selagen. And of course, you know, uh, Selagen helped uh, Jing Ying Jie uh, gradually got out from her depressive condition. And for that, she was so thankful that she actually agreed to perform on our 10th anniversary. You know, yeah, totally at her. And then during on stage at that time, she actually shared, you know, how Selagen has actually benefited her. Okay, you got to scan the QR code on that. So these are really just some of the um, conditions, you know, that, you know, uh, Selagen has helped with a very, a big variety of them. The more, more interesting is why the doctors themselves take Selagen. Selagen is very well written up in Rob's report. Some of you who actually know what a Rob report is, right? A Rob report is actually a luxury lifestyle magazine for the rich and famous in America. And they have the very good write-ups that actually describe the, how uh, Selagen and how some of the doctors have been experiencing it. In fact, you know, you just Google Dr. Selagen, right? Uh, Dr. and Selagen, you'll realize that a lot of all these doctors, you know, especially anti-aging doctors, you know, they not only use it for their patients, they actually use it for themselves too. And I like, like what Dr. Uzi always say, right? Selagen is like the Rolls Royce of supplement for your human body. And then in fact, one of the most famous uh, aesthetic surgeon in Philippines, that's Dr. Luzero, also another good friend of mine. He actually uses Selagen to help his patients to uh, speed up their healing after their surgery. And he actually realizes that Selagen was great in complementing up his practices. Now, so for those who are kind of wondering now, okay, so how much would a, a cost of a cell, a marine cell therapy be like? You know, if you kind of compare it to, you know, all your cell therapy by injectables, you actually realize it's less than a fraction of the, the cost, right? 
uh, you know, slightly less than sing, sing $5,000 a year, you know, for, for a whole year, you know, I think, you know, that is actually a good price to pay for having, uh, you know, good health and uh, relieving a lot of your chronic health issues. So in, in summary, okay, so what is the Celligence Cell Therapy Supplement? Okay, first is, is BioDNA Cellular Marine Complex. It's a super antioxidant. Of course, it has all the benefits that you saw. The cold extraction technology is what enables it to have very high quality. And more important, all the ingredients that you see inside, what we call synergistically blended, right? And when they are all blended in like that, they become very complete and they actually complement each other. And of course, very important, it has very high efficacy because you know it's a, it's, it's a live fish DNA, it's fully digestible and easily enters the cells. So how should you evaluate Celagen? Now our body on average, right, you know, some, some cells will take uh, faster to regenerate, some will take slower to regenerate. I would say, you know, on average, every three months, okay, your cells in the whole body undergo one whole cycle of change. So, you know, if you want to evaluate Celagen, I would say give yourself a good three months evaluation period, okay? Then you should be able to, you know, observe uh, observable differences, okay? Be it from energy, be it from uh, some of your health conditions getting better. Uh, this is our typical recommendation. You know, you start with two capsules a day to boost the repair because especially if the body needs um, uh, some major repair for a start, you know, starting with two capsules a day uh, would, would help. And then uh, the most ideal time to take it is actually morning on an empty stomach. Okay, I would say drink a lot of water because uh, when cell starts to repair itself, you know, they, they take in a lot of water because uh, a big bulk of your cell is water. And one very interesting thing I always tell people to, to do that. You know, if you are taking all the other supplements that you had, you can choose to do this, okay? Just take Celagen on yourself and you can stop and then observe for yourself what's the difference. For most of my customers, uh, typically, once they started on Celagen, they would just stay with Celagen and then, you know, they on, on average typically uh, stop the rest of the other supplements. So for some of you who are kind of getting tired of your cocktail or supplements, you know, this is also something that you can consider because, you know, it's like, you know, uh, one, uh, one supplement that can actually replace quite a fair bit of your other supplements, okay? So in short, you know, the, the, the whole gist of today is really, you know, there is really only one disease, okay? And that disease is really of your cells not functioning properly and one solution, right? Which is cell repair, replacement, and rejuvenation. Now, if you are really interested to find out uh, more about this, you know, and, and have a discussion, you know, this is my contact. Feel free to, to scan the QR code or there's my number right at the bottom. You know, feel free to give me a thinker or give me a text more than happy to, to, to have a chat with you. And that's really one of my tagline. I really help people to slow down their aging and stay healthy, okay, using various natural manners, okay. Uh, do I have time for uh, some Q&A right now? So I will stop share here and I'll bring Gina back. And then, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see whether, you know, some of you may have uh, questions in your chat group. Hi, Gina. Nice Hi. again. Wow, very touching videos. Yeah. Really is uh, amazing to see uh, lives changing, you know, yeah. or saving and then, you know, to get a second chance. Yeah. That's the most precious things. True. Yeah. yeah. So, okay. Uh, without anything, let's go on to the questions. I have uh, two questions, um, which uh, is the uh, main thing is that, uh, you know, there are so many cell therapies out there. How do we know which is best for us? And then how do you choose the correct cellular therapy or, you know, uh, cell therapy uh, which will suit our body? And then, you know, how uh, there are some stem cell therapy and then, and then how does, you know, best choice, how to evaluate which is the most suitable uh, thing for us? Mm, okay, I think that's a very good uh, question, Gina. I mean, I get that all the time, right? Uh, now, thanks to lately, somebody called Mr. Google these days, right? You know, really, I mean, the information is really out there, right? I mean, to me, even with, with Celagen itself, right? I mean, you have, you have heard me. What I really encourage you to really go, go Google, okay? Just say Google up Celagen, research Celagen, whatever it is, and see what pops up, okay? Now, chances are, because I, I know I've, I've done it, because when I first started it, evaluating cellular, right? You know, chances are you probably only hear, you know, uh, different 
centers, right? Different uh, anti-aging doctors, you know, people who uh, have reputation, say, talk about uh, Selagen and you know what, the effects they have. You can Google papers now. Likewise, you can also Google any, uh, I would say any other cell therapy supplement out there and read what are the general feedbacks from there. You know, I know, for example, you know, uh, in, in UAE itself, you know, and in the Philippines, you know, they, they do they do kind of send out warnings against certain cell therapy products because, you know, uh, of overclaims and so forth. So I would say, you know, read as much as you can, you know, Google it up. You know, we Google these days, you know, you can get uh, a lot of information, okay? And of course, you know, if, if there are products that you Google and nothing comes out, then you want to be a little careful, right? So I, I want to kind of get different people's opinion, you know, even though you have heard what I've gone through today. I, I would say Mr. Google is a great way to actually help you get the information that you need. Uh, of course, if you want me to point you to kind of some of the, uh, the, the official websites to read more about it, you know, by all means, uh, let me know. Now, the other uh, question that, uh, Gina Brown is very interesting. I, I hear this all the time that, you know, people say that, you know, oh, when I take cell therapy supplement, I'm consuming stem cells and I'm consuming stem cells, these stem cells go into the body. It helps you to repair, uh, you know, various parts of the body and that's how it works, okay? Now, the thing is, if you again go and Google uh, stem cell, in fact, I think there's a, a Singapore HSA put out a very uh, interesting write-up, okay? If you don't understand how stem cell uh, uh procedures work right now even with those where you go into the clinic where you inject the stem cells in the body right stem cells you know when they first extract them right got to be kept in very cold temperature in fact it's almost in deep freeze to preserve them and then before they are used right before they are used they are actually brought back up to room temperature before they're injected you know whether it be in, in certain injured areas or like you know in the in the swiss clinics injected throughout the whole body in fact for stem cells to work they actually have to be administered in that fashion okay they cannot be they they first of course you know you, you look at supplements you know the temperature is definitely not uh you know not conducive enough to keep stem cells uh you know uh alive right and then, of course, if you consume them, that again is not the way that you know uh, stem cells treatment are, uh, are administered. And so, so, so yeah, there's a be cautious when you hear people say you consume stem cells and the stem cells automatically go to the body to, to, to repair them. Okay, so that, 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 that's not how it works. That's why that's I told the pain to, uh, to kind of explain how cellulogen works because cellulogen is really not stem cells. Okay. Um, um, have I answered your questions, Gina? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, okay. okay, then another thing is that, you know, um, this is very good because it's repairing from inside out, you know. Yeah. But then a lot of people nowadays, they know only aesthetic, you know, which is the outer repair, which people go for Botox or fillers or, you know, or cosmetic surgeries. And then typically it started off with ladies with in the 50s, then slowly by 40s, it's a must that they want couple of books, you know, then it will go into 30s. When you are in sales, you want to be more you and more youthful. Then nowadays, you even see the youth, like 25, 23, starting to, to want to have a couple of fillers and all these things. Yeah. So what is about the cell therapy? Because it's called repairing from inside out. When is the correct age? Yeah, that, that's a very good uh, kickstart. Yeah, that's a very good question. You know, people, people always say that, oh, you now I wait until I get old before I you know start taking something like that. In fact, you know, I would say that if you learn about it, you should start as early as possible. Okay, because I, I do have one friend who at this started when she was in her early 20s. And believe me, 10 years later, right when I look back at her photos. Uh, you know, compared to, to 10 years later and 10 years ago, you know, it's like she's kind of being frozen in age, right? So if you realize in some of the photos, that's, so that's what stereotype does because when your body, right, once it hits the, the 20s, whether you like it or not, even though you're very active and stuff like that, your body starts battling the, the, the effects of premature aging, okay? And in this, this lifestyle, with all the stress, you know, lifestyle, you know, and, and so forth, we, we are not treating our body very, uh, very well. So, you know, in order to counter some of these, you know, that's where things like uh, Stelogen is very useful because you, 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 you counter back all the damages that's being done. And remember the cells, you know, if, if, 
if they if they if the copies that they make become weaker and weaker, right? The, the, the more they photocopy that your cells become weaker. So you want to make sure that your cells stay as healthy as possible from the younger age possible. So in fact, if you ask me, I would recommend that you know people who are uh, you know in their early 20s, right? Consider consider uh, starting on that because uh, in this high stress society, what you also find that cellogen uh, gives you the vitality and the energy. And besides that, the beauty that it gives you is from internal. And because your skin firms up naturally because of the, uh, the, the collagen and the, and the peptides. Uh, the, in fact, that's one of the effects that most ladies notice. Okay, The ladies are more discerning. Okay, Within uh, maybe about two or three weeks after taking it, they find that you know, their, their skin firms up. Uh, in, in many of the cases, you know, because the, the skin remains so firm and, and tangy that they find that, you know, they don't have to go to some, some of these uh, beauty procedures. Lah. So if you're seriously thinking about like uh, that, you know, uh, uh, going for a procedure, I say, yeah, why, why don't you give uh, Salajan a chance, try for six months, and you'll find that, you know, hey, it firms you up and you feel better and you feel more confident, the mood is better, and that's important, right? It's internal beauty and internal beauty radiates up. Yeah. Because not only the that it repairs your beauty from inside out, the mind also it repairs, yes. keep it your mind better, active and fresh. That's most important. Yeah. So thank you so much, Keith, for your time today. And then since this uh, entrepreneurial links our program is to promote wealth, uh, health, wealth and happiness. Today we covered health. Next week we are covering about wealth how we can, can uh, keep our wealth, and then uh, we have a topic about that. And at the same time, uh, we are also entrepreneurs link is as the, you can hear is an entrepreneur thing. So we are promoting startups, we are promoting brands, and then we are promoting uh, how people can make a fast, uh, uh, you know, a quick entry into the market. So this program will be broadcast also live, in um, Indonesia, Vietnam, Cambodia, and Myanmar, and then a few other countries, including Japan. So for those who are interested to uh, do a business based on uh, Salajan that uh, Kate has just mentioned, you can uh, contact him and then uh, as his numbers, or you can write to our Facebook page, Messengers, uh, and ask about how to go to uh, get this product to start in your countries or uh, how to kick start and then let us know your country and your location and we will connect to you uh, or we will link you up correctly. So thank you so much. My name is uh, Gina Lisa and I'm also a uh, serial entrepreneur at the same time um, your host for today and we are promoting uh, entrepreneurship and then uh, startups and then we would like to see more startups from uh, emerging countries to come and join us talk about it thank you for your time and then we'll see you next week bye <laughs>